I need a book, bro. How's it going? Pretty good, how about you? Pretty good. I'm looking to just get these two books for my nephew. Yeah, of course. Have you ever seen that book? I think I actually have. Just the fact that it says Karen's Itchy Pussy is just <laughs> so funny. Karen's Itchy Pussy. <laughs> Karen's Itchy Pussy. <laughs> my nephew, she just learned how to read. I was like reading some of the inside and like they just say curse words and she deserves to learn like one way or another. Curse words, yeah. I get that. This one isn't ringing up so I'm gonna ask, ask your manager, okay. Yeah. Okay. Would you say that they're like both inappropriate? For a small child, <laughs> probably. Jess, can we read it together? We have Karen's itchy pussy. Once upon a time, there was a lady named Karen who had a fluffy itchy pussy. <laughs> okay, that was it. Yeah, this, let me keep, I gotta try and figure out what it is. These are both my books. They are? Yeah. Now you brought these in with you? Yeah. I like shoved them in my pants and then I came up here and asked if you guys had these. Okay, now that's just weird. Um, I, don't, I don't get what's going on here. You brought stuff in the store, shoved down your pants. Correct. Okay, that's just weird. Uh, sorry, Ed. Yeah, that's I didn't mean to weird you out. That's... Yeah. So you did not get this off our shelf? Oh, no. Are you 100% sure of that? I could be 95% sure, and you can go throughout your day with that 5%. Th this is just totally weird. <sighs> I, I guess I'm the first. Ed, I'm gonna be honest, you are so sexy. I think you need to go. Okay. I think I'm gonna oh, keep both I, of these. I gotta get that one back. This is weird. You're the weirdest person I've ever had in my store. That's kind of insulting. I guess I could just take the book and I can head out. No, I gotta see what my own hands are. I have no pictures in here. Okay, guys, this is not how no it should have went. Man, I need to find a book. Oh, dude, perfect. I'm just looking to purchase this book. A step-by-step -step guide how to understand women, and there is nothing in this book. Why would that be? <laughs> it's kind of a joke. So someone's like pranking me. Yeah. Do you know how to understand women? No, I don't. <laughs> me, me either. As Jewish world said, like all girls are the same. Yeah. <laughs> what if I told you I was like pranking you? Yeah, I think you were. Did I, it was the good prank? Yeah. I made you smile? You sure did. Oh, I'm glad I made her smile. Elderly woman, they deserve a smile. Making her smile, that made my day better. And hopefully it made your guys' day better too. All right, next prank. So many books here, man. You ever see a book like this before? No, I didn't. Need to make a how to live with a small one. <laughs> oh. How's it going? I need some advice. Yeah. So I just found this book. How to live with a huge penis, advice, meditations, and wisdom for men. I'm like a little nervous to buy it. I want it to help me. Yeah, I, I don't blame it. Do you struggle with that issue or? I personally don't. A lot of it seems to be kind of just like personal stories of how people dealt with. Perfect, so I can it? relate. I didn't know you guys had an inventory of books like these. I am honestly surprised as well. I love like naughty books. Mm -hmm. Um, excuse me, sir. Yeah? Can I ask for your advice on something? Sure. Me and him were just talking about them. I have no opinion on this, sir. This one right here, I kind of have like a problem learning to read it in order to cope Sir, with it. Sir, with all due respect, I do not want to hear about the size of your genitalia. <laughs> I didn't mean to offend you. No, sir, I'm sorry. No, I'm done with you. <laughs> oh my God, I'm so embarrassed. These are my books. Oh. You got pranked? Would you like to say anything? Not really. <laughs> okay, but just know you have been pranked. Oh my gosh, it was a good reaction, but I need to talk to him to let him know I was just joking. I'm so sorry, I would just like to say something, but I just want him to know that I actually do have a huge penis. I do not have a small one. Just to put that out there. Okay. Guys, there's a gentleman in the back, and I told him I had a small penis. Letting you guys know too, it is actually huge from the book. So just to put that out there. What is wrong with me? I'm just saying I'm probably one of the most awkwardest people out there. But when he was like, sir, I don't need to, oh my gosh, I just started laughing. Before I leave, I was just letting you two know how to live with a huge penis. It's a great book, and I'm going home to read it. You probably should. <laughs> Maybe you can take notes. <laughs> Okay, I didn't get
What the? Nanas? When it comes to filming pranks, I'm one of the most awkwardest people. But I'm really glad to let him know that I actually have a huge penis instead of a small one. Because if someone were to know I have a small penis... Ed, I just need the book. Ed, Ed, I just, oh, Ed no please. Ed, I just story. need And you get out of here. You get out of here You right get out of here. You get out of here. I just want my book back, guys. Ed, I need the book. Just take it and get the book. Oh, can we at least end on good terms? Oh, no. Ed, get out of here. Get out of Ed, here don't now. talk to me like that, Ed. God. Can you believe that? Yeah, I can. Well guys, today I'm going to go ahead and be doing asking to buy inappropriate books prank. Maybe Karen's itchy pussy made them feel some type of way. But man, once Ed saw the camera, he flipped shit. Get that camera away from me. Ed? Ed, stop. You're not getting my tag. Ed, I stole this book from you guys. And you handed it to me and I left. So how do you feel now? Sir, come help. Ed is scaring me and I need help. I'm not a man. I'm actually a female. I walked inside of the store. I asked Ed if he wanted Karen's itchy pussy. Who wants that? Anyway. What the? How about go up to sleep? <laughs> I say that to my kids all the time. How about ass eating for beginners? Oh my gosh, Ed. He had inappropriate books. Then he asked if we had the books. Then he said, no, he brought the books in. Damn it. Forget this. I guess I'm not getting arrested. Oh, I think I'm just gonna head out. Respectfully, I'll see you later. Ed, I'll meet you again one day. And guys, just like that again, you leave. Most of the pranks that we did so far actually went amazing. What the f <laughs> I don't really like to judge, but what the f was that? See, in this world, we don't judge. No matter what you look like, what you wear, or what you buy, nothing is wrong with you. Oh, excuse me, ma'am. I just bought a book from here. It's called Karen's Itchy Pussy. Do you like it? Yeah. I haven't bought this one yet, but it's the book with no pictures. You bought that from here? No, I haven't bought it yet. And you're ripping the pages? Shh. We did this together. I'll see you later. Oh, perfect. Can I interest you in an itchy pussy? I'm gonna get him to beat the fuck out of you. Wait, you're gonna beat the fuck out of me? I don't think you'd beat the shit out of me. Okay, cool, cool. So what are you watching? Porn? Oh, I said it first, porn. No, your mom. You little sick mom. bastard. These people, they sort the violence. They see me and they want to beat the fuck out of me. He wasn't about it. That's why I sat there and he didn't do nothing about it. Um, I don't mean to bother you. So I'm like, I'm going out to people today, like asking if they have itchy pussies. <laughs> do I have an itchy pussy? Yes. No, do you have itchy pussy? I don't know yet, I'm trying to figure that out. See, the last guy I asked, he sat there and he told me he was going to beat the shit out of me. So I had to come try it out again. I feel like we all learned something here today. And I made you laugh, man, hey. See you later, man, all right? Enjoy yourself. Thank you for not wanting to beat me. There's also other people in life who get upset about filming, like this guy right here. Uh, how's it going, man? I don't want that. I don't want that. You don't want what? <laughs> At this point, I'm just guessing it all. Don't put that on YouTube. I'm putting it on YouTube. No, you can't. Yes, I am. It's illegal. This is my first video. Be careful with that. I'm bullshitting you. I've been doing this for three years, so everything you're saying is bullshit. Yeah. yeah. Well, then you're an asshole, probably. He tried lying to me, so you're the asshole. No, I don't. I can read right through his bullshit. He tried lying to me. Who the hell does he think he is? He's talking to Zach Craig. That's who I am. Ah, my next suspect. Hey. I'm like asking my viewers, like, do you think I'm awkward? Um, no. Stop, be for real. Tell him. No, you tell him right now. I mean, it's just how you came up to me. One day I'm going to find a girlfriend and we're going to go from there. Do you think I have a chance? No way. Yo, you lying. How old do you think I am? <laughs> All right, now let me guess you. I'd probably say like 19. <laughs> oh my God. I underestimate some of these mall workers and their age. I want to ask another one. Uh, sir? What's good, bro? Can I guess your age? Yeah. 19. 16. Oh my god, bro! Bro! There's no way. Uh, no. Nah. nah, bro. Never again am I talking to a mall employee. Oh, Spencer's. Dude, I love this place. Oh my goodness, it's still here. My good friend Jimmy, he sent me a text and he told me that they were selling my merch out of Spencer's in this mall. What the fuck? <laughs> Any way, like you can like take this down. Where? Like the entire store. Look, can you like elaborate on the question? I'm sorry, man. No, all good. So, uh, Danny Duncan. Huh? 
Fred Beyer. Is there anything you could get it for me? Oh, yeah. Perfect. Oh, okay, cool. You got the ladder. Nice. A little heavy? Here you go. Oh, it is a little heavy. This is Danny Duncan, right? Yeah. But, like, this is Fred Beyer. Yeah. So, like, I know what I have to do. What are you going to do? Fred, that was for you. I disposed of it. Danny Duncan will get his revenge! OG? I'll ask him if I get an OG. No. You know what an OG is? Are we, you know what a gangster? I'm not. Dude, Taco is part gangster, but me? Yeah. I don't mess with none of that. You gotta be. Retired? Retired, 72. So you retired from being a gangster. Yo, that's what's up, my man. That's awesome. Would you like to scrap? You think you beat me? I think so. <laughs> Oh, you're funny, man. You look me up and down. He said, I think so. Like, yo, you're a funny guy, man. Hey, I'll see you later. You work here, right? I do, yes. I was looking at this book. It's called, like, The Book with No Pictures. And like, I was just looking at it and, like, it. Uh... Fun fact no camera. Thanks for that. Oh, I guess I can just get it over it now and show you. Take it before I leave. Yeah, well, it's. Thank it's... You. It's already done and over with. Thanks. Yeah, you can go now. Oh, right. no, not Karen. No, not Karen. Did you pussy? Karen, did you pussy of mine? Karen. What was that? Karen, it's your pussy. It's named. Look. Go ahead. Go ahead. What? Get camera. Okay. Go, go. Look, you don't gotta be so rude. Yes, I do. I can be if I want to. I work here. Where's the manager? Me. Oh shit, you got me. I'm leaving. I don't want no problems. Oh god damn, I forgot to tell you it's my book. Damn it, dude. Julia, I forgot to tell you the I'm not the book be that. Part of this. Wait, Julia, the book that you took was mine. Boot Julia. Julia what the and I'm bad like the Barbie. I'm a doll, but I still wanna party. Pink felt like I'm ready to bend. I'm a ten, so I pull in a can. Like How's it going? What's up, buddy? What do you guys need? Oh, I'm just looking for a bed. I just like to get comfortable. This room I can take my pants off. I would just take the pants off. I just like to get comfortable. No. Well this was a bust. Have you ever had come in here about naked and jump on the bed? Nope. Oh, have you ever thought about it? Have you ever thought about it? Yes, I have. That's why I'm asking. No, that would never happen here. I don't allow that shit in my store. Wait, you don't come in here and get butt naked, you mean? No, you don't. You don't. Definitely not. Okay. Nobody does. Yeah. We're going to head out, and uh, thank you for not choking me. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Appreciate not you, man. At all. You guys have a good day. Thank you, man. You too. And you guys see, it's that easy. As long as you're respectful, they won't choke you.